Hi, I'm Andy with Skinner Sights, and today we're going to be taking a look at our folding takedown carrying bag for your takedown rifle or shotgun. This bag is designed to also hold some different survival accessories. We're going to take a good look at that right now. On the outside of our bag, first of all, we've got two carry attachment spots for fastening quick detachable swivels. We carry this sling on our website for your rifle. It's called our Minimal Sling. You'll find it on our website, case page www.skinnersights.com These can quick detach and then be used on your firearm if it has sling attachment points. Inside our bag, which we unbuckle and open up, so we call it the folding takedown case, we find some survival gear. Now the items I'm going to show you here are not offered from our website, but they are something that you might already have, you can get at your local outdoor store, uh, wherever it's just the good things that you want to take with you. We do not supply them with the bag, but we show them here for the illustration of how it can be used. Some good parachute cord. This is a high tensile strength cord, better than most paracord. And there's 100 feet of it here. You can use it to build shelters, put a food cache up in a tree to keep it out of the reach of bears, etc. Always good to have some rope with you. Inside a small pouch that's sewn on the outside of our bag, I have a tactical style flashlight not bad to have so you're not left out in the dark not really afraid of the dark it's just sometimes those things that are in the dark I like to see them before they see me we have some waterproof matches in a waterproof match container it's always good to get the strike anywhere matches if you have to rub two sticks together to make a fire matches are good to rub together also in our case I've included for my use, one of these Mylar space blankets. It reflects body heat, so you can wrap it around yourself. It's waterproof, windproof. You can put it over the top of your shelter to repel moisture. And it's just a great item to have. Doesn't take up much space. You can fold it back up. It also works as a signal flash uh, in case you need a signal for an airplane. A compass. GPS is great to have, but they run on batteries. If you have any experience like I do with batteries, eventually they run out. And so, compass, time-worn, proven, tested, never, never let me down. And in this case, I threw in one of my magnesium fire starters. Good to have the matches or a lighter, but this will also work even when it's wet. You shave off the magnesium, give it the strike, and it lights the fire. All those things are just great to have, and the reason for showing them to you today is they all fit inside this pouch on the inside of our folding takedown case. Something else I want to show you today is the Ontario Knife Company RAT7 Survival Knife. And when I went looking for a knife that I could include and recommend with our survival bag, I wanted something that was made in the USA, was durable, would never let you down in a survival situation, constructed of premium materials, and suitable for the task. The RAT7, made by the Ontario Knife Company, who's been making knives for 125 years in the state of New York, uh, this knife is 3 16 inch thick. It's constructed of 1095 carbon steel, tempered perfectly to hold an edge, powder coated, comes razor sharp right out of the package. And the reason I chose this knife, it's not because this is the knife that I would wear on my hip every day, uh, just out and about and doing things. It's a little big for that. But what it is, is it's small enough to gut a fish, to skin a deer, quarter a moose, chop down small trees and limbs, make a shelter, you can use it for uh, self-defense. You can use it for hunting. It's just a great knife for all-around survival use. I just couldn't find anything better. So we sewed a couple of loops inside of our case so that it would accept the Molly Web attachment system of the Ontario case. It's a ballistic nylon case with a hard plastic liner. Protects that knife, keeps it from cutting through. Snaps easily into place and yet securely. And then the case itself fastens to our case with these Molly Web attachment points that we have sewn in. It can also be detached and worn on your belt, but when you have it, your survival kit, it's attached right there and it won't come off, and you know that you've got it when you hit the field. This bag is designed to be used with your horseback trips, your four-wheeler, your quad, attach it to the raft platform in your in your rowing platform in your your raft uh, you put it in your bush plane under the seat in your four-wheel drive 
it's just good to have with you all the time because if you have this you're going to sleep a lot better at night in case that you have to spend it out and alone on the outside of our bag we have a pouch that's sized to hold our box of pistol ammunition or it could hold a couple of magazines for a larger a different kind of rifle a couple of boxes of rifle ammo whichever i've chosen the pistol caliber for my particular bag because i have this really nice Kiapa made 92 Winchester clone takedown 44 Magnum. This is just so slick. Comes apart into two pieces, assembles easily. And now I've got a 44 Magnum, 50 rounds of ammo, my survival gear, and my Ontario Knife Company Rat 7 Knife. With those things, I can stay in the wilderness a long, long time.